No, I 100% agree. All right, so let's go over to Rookie of the Year. I want to hear your guys' first. I think Edwards has been playing great. Who? Uh, but I think LaMelo Ball is still Rookie of the Year right now. I get you. I get you. I think I 100% LaMelo Ball's season stats are 15.8 points per game, 6 rebounds, 6.3 assists per game. I know people are out there, Tyrese Halliburton has been playing so good. <laughs> I think he's like three. Uh, he is three. And the reason why Tyrese isn't getting it is LaMelo, last time I checked, has played 36 games and started 18 of those. Well, and Tyrese has played 33 games and has only started three of those games. Well, let's look at Ty. I want to look at Tyrese and Halliburton's stats. Tyrese's stats aren't means. better, but I think his efficiency and his shooting splits and PR are all better. Don't take my word on that. I'm. Well, that's because Tyrese Halliburton, like, maybe, like. Comes a, off the bench. Right, he does, but he's like a. <laughs> isn't he's like a. Isn't oh, LaMelo created a, in a lab? A better, he's like a, a great. I love, huh? Or better passer. Oh, Lamelo is better physically built. Like he has the perfect physical profile, six seven, mm -hmm. uh, two hundred pounds. Not two hundred pounds. Probably one hundred eighty five, one hundred ninety. But he'll probably get up to two ten. Mm -hmm. He has the length to defend anybody and to yeah. get like into passing lanes. He has the amazing has basketball he been IQ. A lot on defense, I think he was right. He's He's good at perimeter defense, but as soon as somebody's right. stronger than him, he gets destroyed because he's right. skin and bones. All right. He needs to put on some weight, essentially. Yeah. But yeah. is he, what is he, 18, 19? So, yeah, like, so he has plenty of time. Yeah, he has plenty of time. And there's steroids. 25. I'd say, right. yeah, put on 20, so, 25 pounds, and he's going to be real good. Yeah. Mm. Once he starts that HGH. All right. All right. What do we say? So, whatever. Just anyway, whatever for, for, for Tyrese Halliburton, 12 oh. points. Uh, 12 points. 5.2 assists, uh, three and a half rebounds. I don't even think Tyrese uh, 1.4 is... steals, though, for the record. 1.4 steals. That's pretty impressive. Uh, you know, I don't even think he's in third place anymore. Lamellos. Third place goes to Emmanuel Quickly. Emmanuel Quickly is really good. I right. literally saw no, Emmanuel. No, I think, I think at some point we have to talk about Patrick, Patrick Williams. Williams, who is the sleeper. His <coughs> number, if you want to talk about a guy whose numbers, they don't say everything. We, we, Patrick Williams is just... He, busting with talent. He Patrick is, Williams is a Paul defense, George. He's going to be quiet. He's more, he's a baby Kawhi. That's no, he's a he baby is. Paul George, which I still think is no, so. I don't, I don't think he has the offensive talent of Paul George, but I think he has the Kawhi hands. But Kawhi, he has the isn't Kawhi a better of offensive Kawhi. player than Paul George? I would. Maybe Kawhi, when he was young. Maybe right now. Could not, like his offense yeah. was not great. Yeah. So like, wasn't Paul George's. He recently developed that offense. I don't know, but Paul George is like, an all-time shooter, and, and I don't know. Paul, Paul George is Patrick crazy Williams talented. Patrick does have offense. a beautiful jumper. If you want to watch a, a nice well, and jumper, and part of the I mean, it's not jumper, perfect, but it yeah. is really nice. It's part a good jumper for a big is three. Also, is, it, it's like dirt three, I think, and like that arc. Williams relies a lot on a, like a super robust mid-range game. Mm -hmm. Like he will pull up, he will hit a floater over you. He's got the size and long arms, you know. He so he will like lay it up over you. He could post you up. Post up night game's not great, but you know, he's got the build. You know, he's got the build to make mm -hmm. it work. Did you guys know Kenyon Martin Jr. is balling out for the Rockets? He's averaging seven since Kenyon Martin Jr., let me pull up his last ten games. This is ridiculous. He's averaging like you guys won't believe. Like give me give me a stat quote that you think Kenyon Martin Jr. is averaging. Uh, I don't know, eighteen points a game. That's actually pretty close. Like this is insane. Listen to his last ten games. His last four games, he's averaging fourteen points. 1.3 steals a game, 1.8 blocks a game, seven rebounds, 52% from the field, 33% from three, 73% uh, from the free throw line, and he's shooting like, I'm trying to see how many threes a night. That's not bad. Kind of insane. I mean, it's not bad, but like, that's not like great. Like, right, that's not, not a rookie like... of the year. That's probably like- Oh, that's not rookie of the year. He's only, but like, to come out of nowhere, like, these are right, his first four stars. He's starts. definitely someone to keep your eye on. Yeah, wanna keep your eye on. He's a second round pick. I wanna know? I want to know the advanced stat of Patrick Williams, like what his, when he's on the floor, what our defensive rating is versus when he's not. His on off. Floor. You probably got to pay for the glasscleaners.com for that. Mm -hmm. That's fucked. Or what is it, glasscleaners.com or clean the glass, know. right? Clean the glass. Knows, so I don't like, know. Let me go on basketball reference. Yeah. Um, I'm going to break this like down for myself. James Wiseman, five. Tyrese Halliburton, four. Manuel Quickly. This is a little bias on my part. Emmanuel quickly has been balling. If you guys want to see Emmanuel quickly in the last 10 games is averaging 14 and a half points, steal a game, two assists per game, two rebounds a game, 37% from three, 40% from the four, and just 22 minutes a night. 
His 36 stats, I guess, would you be averaging like 20 points a night. I don't know math, so I can't do that in my head. And then you got over here Anthony Edwards, who I think is in second place behind LaMelo Ball, yeah. averaging in the past 10 games 21 points, one and a half steals, half a block, 2.5 assists, five and a half rebounds, and 34% from three, 40% from field, which is awesome <coughs> because his, his last four games, listen to this, against the Lakers, he shot 50% from the field, 42% from three. Fall, the game before that, literally the same thing. Game before that, literally the same thing. Game before that, four games in a row he was shooting. He's looking about like an elite scorer. Yeah, I think this is what I want to say. Anthony Edwards combo, he has the body type of James Harden, that like thick boy, like build, you know really what I mean? Dude, I think it's but like Russell Westbrook. I was going to say Dwayne Wade. Dwayne no, Wade. Dwayne and, Wade's actually a good comp. Dwayne like Wade that. and James Harden. He has a game. He wants to play like James Harden. A little more like Dwayne Wade, though. But he's more like Dwayne Wade. Yeah. That's what I'm saying. Like, he wants to be like James when he takes shots sometimes, when he does his little dribble moves and attacks the rim, but he's built more like a, a big boy version, like a country thick version of Dwayne Wade. Yeah. Like, what is, how tall is he? He's 6'4", six six Dwayne Wade. Six, yeah, 6'4", 6'5", 6'5", probably listed, but he's probably 6'4". Fair enough. 